Today, Kevin and I are gonna be trying Beyond Raw. It says Lit. These are a dietary supplement. Uh, this is the Gummy Worm, and then the rest of these are all Jolly Rancher. Mm -hmm. So this is the Watermelon. Uh, blue Raspberry and Green Apple. These were $3.19 each at uh, GNC. I had never heard of this brand before. We went in GNC. So the Gummy Worm, um, it doesn't have, like I said, Jolly Rancher on it, but these all only have 20 calories a can. So you're getting a 16 ounce can and it's only 20 calories. It is clinically dosed, zero sugar. It has 250 milligrams of caffeine. Um, it has uh, all kinds of other stuff. It has three grams of L citrulline, 3.2 grams of beta alkaline, 100 milligrams of neurofactor. I think it's mostly an energy drink. It's um, got additional stuff, but it's mostly an energy drink. It says uh, the directions say, as a dietary supplement, consume one can pre workout. And then on non training days, consume one can for additional energy and focus. So basically, they would like for you to drink one can a day, no matter what you're doing. <laughs> um, different purposes. Though. Different purposes. It says, warning consult your physician prior to using this product if you are pregnant, nursing, taking medication under 18 years of age or have a medical condition. Discontinue use two weeks prior to surgery. Wow, two weeks prior yeah. to surgery. That, we haven't heard that on the have we? I haven't heard that warning um, before. For adult use only, taking this product may cause tingling and flushing sensations. These sensations may be enhanced if taken close to or during exercise. This is gluten-free, sugar-free. Uh, and they're telling you again, it contains 250 milligrams of caffeine. Uh, it's a lot of caffeine. Yes. It's on the high end of a ca an energy drink. Yes. Okay. You know, we've had energy drinks before that said it may cause tingling or people have said that they felt tingling. We've never had that issue, but we've done, we're not sitting here drinking the whole thing all at one time. Either. Right. Uh, it says, built by science, driven by obsession, elevated through innovation. If it's on our labels, then it's in our cans. Get lit and train with focus, intensity, and pumps. Get lit. Get lit. Uh, proven <laughs> ingredients, proven doses, clinical quality, real science, real results. These statements have not been evaluated by the Food and Drug Administration. <laughs> this product is not intended to diagnose, treat, cure, or prevent any disease. That's keep, hilarious. Keep out of reach of children. Distributed by General Nutrition Corporate. So this is a GNC oh, drink. Oh, brand. That's ah, interesting. No wonder we had never seen it before because, you know, you see all these and drinks. And we don't go on GNC very often. No. It, how long? It had probably been a year. Probably close to probably a year. Probably a year. we were looking for something there. specific, I'm yeah. sure. Yeah. This is uh, from Pittsburgh, Pennsylvania. I, do, this I do think it's hilarious that they're saying all this stuff. And then right below that, they say, but none of this has been a, been a, uh, proven to do anything. Yeah. <laughs> Ooh, wow. That's so great. Did you? <laughs> we um, were expecting these to be clear. Well, I thought it would be clear. Did you ever expect Slimer yeah, for real, in a can. can? Oh my gosh. There, I have it's a friend, I, I will not call him out. I have a friend that is the same color as his hair. And I think All the he, time, didn't it used to be something else? I think he's wonderful. Um, it used to be something else though, didn't it? I've the only, color? I've, I only remember him having that color. I thought it was different. Yeah, mine. but I love it. And he'll know when he watches this video that I'm talking about hey. it. If you can rock the green slime color hair, then go for it. I, can, I can never do that. He can totally rock it. He gets away with it. Oh it's gosh, good. that's so good. It's very, very sweet. Mm -hmm. I mean, for an energy drink, that sometimes energy drinks are kind of icky, uh, tastes like medicine and stuff. This is really good. For 20 calories for the can. Oh, it's very candy-like. Um, it's candy-like, but um, they're saying gummy worm. And I kind of understand why they're saying that bit. because it has that like a, a jello. To me, it reminds me of like a, a jello flavor. Yeah. Like if you. It's not, not really lime. No, no, no. It's not lime. But just um, if you combined like a, uh, like a strawberry jello flavor and maybe an orange, if you combine a different bunch of different flavors of jello. It has that kind of flavor right. to it, of a combination of flavors. To me, it doesn't have a specific flavor. It just tastes sweet. Yes. Oh, it's very. <laughs> it doesn't very have sweet. a like. This tastes like. Right. It really doesn't yes. have. Yes. But it it it's nice. If you like candy, 
then you're yeah, gonna like kind of, that. I agree. It's kind of a mixture of like a mm -hmm. raspberry, strawberry, blueberry. There's rasp a bunch I mean, of all different, kinds of different stuff yeah. mixed together. Yeah, that's to give you an overall thing. candy uh, yeah. flavor. I think that's exactly why they call it uh, gummy worm. I think it's good. Um, I mean, I don't want to sit and drink 250 can, uh, milligrams of caffeine in a can, but. So this, are you drinking out of the can or the? I'm drinking the, out of the glass. But oh, well you can do either good. one. This is the watermelon, but it's Jolly Rancher. Wow. Ooh, old you know what? As you bring it to your nose, mm -hmm. if you've ever eaten Jolly Ranchers, even if you haven't had them in years, you immediately know that flavor. It's like mm -hmm. if you haven't rode a bike for years, you can still pick up a bike and ride a bike. It's the same thing. Once, you, once you've smelled that, tasted that, you know it, even if it's been a long time. Mm -hmm. That it is incredible. Melted Jolly Rancher, that's exactly what it is. It is incredible. It is sweet, it mm -hmm. is delicious. It's got a little tartness to it, which the, the Jolly Rancher always have had just a little bite to them. I'm ending, and when I close my mouth and breathe through my nose, it's just like all sweet. Mm -hmm. Very, oh, yeah. very sweet. Super, super sweet. I love it. I think that. it's so strong when you first take a drink of it. It is so strong. The flavor is that it's almost overwhelming your taste buds, you know? That's going to be hard to beat, I think, that watermelon. Because yeah. I like the watermelon more than the gummy I do, too. And honestly, the watermelon Jolly Rancher is some of my favorite ones. So. The, the interesting thing is so are the green apples. So it'll be interesting to see which The green apple is like. pretty strong. You'll probably want to drink out of this cup because I didn't leave you much in there. This is the blue raspberry. This one. Mm, yeah, pretty much tastes just like a... Now, when we were kids, I don't remember there being a blue raspberry flavor. And maybe, maybe it was. Maybe it was around... I'm talking about the late 70s, very, very early 80s. I do not remember blue raspberry. Remember. It didn't seem like blue raspberry came along until later on, like when Andrew was born, you I know? No um, I don't remember eating Jolly Rancher though. But kidding. maybe it was always there and I just I just was always buying the cinnamon or something. I love, oh, I ate them all the time. Yeah, that's really good, I like them. That is a great blue raspberry. That it, It's literally like melted, melted Jolly Rancher. Mm -hmm. yeah, yeah, it's very, very good. Now my, my candy as a kid was the now layers. Now uh, layers and Starburst. Yeah, but I was a Jolly, my two would be Jolly Rancher and Bomb Pop. Yeah. Not Bomb Pop. Uh, the one with the gum in the middle. Oh. Blow Pop. Blow, pops, yeah. blow Pop. Not Bomb Pop. Blow Pop. So Blow Pops. I had a Blow Pop all the time because the, I like that gum in the middle. So like you got the sucker, but then you you got extra bonus because you were able to have the gum. To let the gum stick around for a while. Yeah. So Jolly Rancher and and Blow Pop were my thing. And I like the, uh, I always like, I like any blow pop, but I like the grape ones a lot. Now that one, it tastes like green apple, but it doesn't taste like Jolly Rancher. I think. It's close. Okay, I'll, I'll tell you why. This tastes like, this is really good. It, Look, it is very good. It tastes like green apple. I love the flavor, could have it. Um, and I'm not a green apple person, but I could have it. This reminds me a lot of the sugar free. The sugar-free. Yeah. So it still is really good. Um, it's got an aftertaste. Mm -hmm. I'm gonna say this sounds crazy. It almost has like a mapley kind of aftertaste. Be I tell you why, because there's a harshness to it, and that's. Do the, you get that kind of a yeah. chemically maple kind of yes. aftertaste? Yeah. Yes, it's very odd, but that's it is a harshness. Yeah, that and one I don't like. Oh really? No. no see, I still I don't, don't really I don't like, like it. The aftertaste. Okay. I don't. I don't mind the flavor as you're drinking. I just don't like the aftertaste. But and I, I do. I do like that little bit of a harshness. I tell you what, though, I could drink any of these three. Uh huh. I and love the colors. Fun. The colors are. Is that green? The gummy worm mm -hmm. different? I think than it's a little the, more fluorescent. Yeah, it is. The uh, the green apple uh, is a little lighter. Yeah. I like that dark the green. The gummy though. the gummy worm one seems to glow. <laughs> <laughs> that one doesn't. I, I think the apple's okay. It's just one. It, it's got that little bit of a, I don't want a maple-y kind of flavor after I've drank something. So yeah, and I do really like that. Yeah. Um, if you've never tried the sugar-free Jolly Ranchers, you should, because I, I like them. Um, because there was a time where I, I was trying to go from having just regular 
candy, but I, did, I still wanted the candy, so I tried them, and I thought they were really nice. But I, you know, for as much, I know this is for me. This is primarily an energy drink. I don't know about the other stuff that it claims, but it's got caffeine in it. It's an energy drink. Mm -hmm. uh, the other stuff may or may not be true. I don't know. I'm not judging that. Right. Um, but I can say the flavors of these are really good. They're super, super. They seem super, super, super sweet, even though they're only 20 calories. Um, and they taste so much better than some of the other energy drinks out there. Like mm -hmm. the little, um, are they Red Bulls? The little cans. Oh, well, you know I, we don't like Red Bulls. I don't know why people drink those because they taste like cough syrup. So we, yeah, I, we really never have like never them. been fans of Red Bulls. No, but I don't know why you would, unless you just don't want that syrupy sweet kind of flavor and you want something more basic. Um, I don't know why you would drink that. But you have to realize too that that we love syrupy sweet stuff. Yeah, that's our thing. I is know. we we want the sweeter it is, that's the true. better. I want melted candy. And some people, yeah, some people probably don't feel healthy yeah. uh, drinking that. Or mm. some people would probably say, uh, some people that are really really health conscious would probably be against that color. Probably they probably would not. Bit. You know, if you're really a purist and you're trying to work out and keep your body clean and all that, you probably would go for they something that, that has the artificial colors in it either. Yeah, that's true. Um, so you know, we just don't. We just don't care. Yeah, we don't. We don't. <laughs> we don't look at that kind of stuff. But right. I'm just saying, as far as flavor goes, I would never buy some of the other energy drinks. Right. Um, I would much rather have this. Yeah. This is full of flavor candy flavors yeah. than those kind of medicinal kind of flavors. And they might have other flavors, but we didn't see any. So like when you went in GNC, there, there was a um, refrigerated, uh, like- They had two They had two, right? on, yeah, one on each side of the store. And these were in the refrigerated chest. Mm -hmm. um, the bad thing about the GNC we went to, it looked like they, had, they, it literally looks like they had emptied the whole store and were restocking the thing. Did you notice that? Like they had boxes of stuff everywhere and it's like they, they, I don't know. It was, it was you know, weird. It was I weird just, how they, I, I guess I had bought The shelves it. were half empty. You know, they did have a whole, uh, and behind the counter, there was like stacks of boxes. You know, they did now that I think about yeah, it. And the shelves, uh, half of them didn't have anything on them. Or I'm anything. just so used to it's going weird. in places like Dollar Tree, I think where they, it's Always constant. Have boxes it's around. constant. You don't <laughs> ever go in there that there's not boxes in the middle. It's just like their norm uh, to have boxes everywhere. And, and, he, and on Honestly, if you think about it, when you go in um, even Kroger, there's always in the freezer section. A, a, there's always stuff out in the middle of the floor where they're putting stuff out, so yeah. um, they're just constantly restocking. I'm grateful they're restocking, uh, but you only had the money to buy one. Mm, probably the gummy bear. I mean the gummy worms. Really? Yeah. Okay. I'm gonna go for the watermelon. Watermelon would be my second. Okay. It's right there with it. Yeah. It's, but all four of them, I see. I like all four. I even like the the green apple. Yeah, I could drink um, all four. Of them. I like all of them. Mm -hmm. So if you get them and buy them, I, I think you're going to be impressed with the flavor. So you'll have to let us know. Have you tried these before? Because they're new to us. They might have been out for years and years, yeah. and we just never knew it before. So I hope you enjoyed the video. I'll have pictures for you at the end. And thanks for watching.